Good afternoon, everyone. We're here at Collaboration 2014. Uh, today, we're going to be talking to Bernie Jaroslow from Quickmix about a brand new product that they're showing here today, the ProJet 1200 from 3D Systems. So, Bernie, tell us about this product that you're showing today. I will. Thanks, Pam. Uh, you know, this is probably the most exciting product we sell, and there are several reasons for that, as you'll see. But you know we're entering into the CAD CAM world, digital dentistry. We know that 3D printing is going to occupy a big part of, of tomorrow's uh, manufacturing processes. Indeed. There's no question. So uh, what we've brought to the market is a 3D systems printer, which is called an SLA-type printer. That stands for stereolithography. Uh, and what this does is it allows us to make burnout patterns uh, up to about 12, 10 to 12 patterns in one hour. So the burnout patterns will then be used for uh, screwing and vesting, uh, burning out, and then either pressing with pressed ceramics or being cast, of course. So, uh, and it's a resin type material that it produces, uh, and, and again, it can be full contour, uh, crowns, uh, bridges, or anything like that. Sure. Well, that's okay. Um, what I'll do is show you the inside of the uh, of the unit and give you an idea of, of how it's done. It's very, very easy to do. Basically, there's a tray of resin liquid, and that's placed here. And these trays are, are inexpensive. They, they, they're somewhere in the $49 range for, and they do up to, depending on the size of the units, anywhere from 60 to 100, 110 units uh, out of a single tray. So it's a very inexpensive uh, material cost. And then all of the units are printed on the bottom of this little tray. So that's the whole print plate. It's very amazing. small. Yeah, and it is. And, it, and once that print plate is in place and locked, that uh, tray of liquid raises up, touches the print tray, and then a very strong laser light source actually starts curing that first layer in whatever design the technician has uh, created in their CAD software. Sure. And then it drops down a little bit, allowing more liquid in, goes back up, and the next layer is cured, and then on and on and on, until finally you have a uh, completed crown, bridge, substructure, whatever it is. And then it's moved over into the built-in UV light curing uh, part here, and that takes about 10 minutes or so when you uh, place that, that uh, tray in there and uh, it signifies uh, when it's done up here in that readout and you've got yourself in less than an hour or approximately an hour, 10 to 12 uh, very accurate, very detailed patterns for burning out. So this is exciting. You know, other printers range in cost from, from 60, 70, 80 up to $100,000. This particular printer, printer uh, sells for so laboratories are, are uh, very excited. They're printing, you know, a, a day's capacity for this. If you let's to make the numbers easy, let's say ten units. That ten units over an eight-hour period gives you eighty units a day in this little unit, this little uh, machine. So it's a it's a high productivity item that's about the size of a coffee maker. I was going to say uh, a very small footprint. A very small footprint and very inexpensive. So that's why I'm so excited about it. Well, Bernie, what booth uh, are you occupying at IET Collaboration? We're in the 500 aisle at 533, I believe it is. Uh, so we hope people will come by and take a look at it. Absolutely. Get here and see this little printer. It's exciting. Thank you. You're welcome. Thanks, man.